Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, it's another grocery haul and everything I've bought this week, including meal ideas. So I wanna get straight into it and show you what we've got this week. So I'm just going to chat you through what I bought and some meal ideas that we have for this week. Um, so I've kind of tried to section it into the meal ideas, um, just so you know what we've got. Um, so first off, we've got some burgers. We're hoping to have some burgers this week. Um, also, we need some new cheese, so hopefully we can have some cheese with the burgers. Um, we have got a brand new air fryer coming this week, which is really exciting. We've been waiting to get one of these for a while. We're quite late onto the bandwagon with that one, but we're really gonna try the burgers uh, and a few of these meals probably in our air fryer. Um, so stay tuned for that. Maybe I'll film a video on that too. Let me know in the comments below if you'd like to see an air fryer video. Um, but burgers is on the list too. Um, and as well, we've absolutely been loving um, these jarred peppers in sandwiches. I mean, we could pad them with burgers as well. Um, mostly sandwiches, salads, that sort of thing. It really jazzes it up um, and brings the sandwiches to the next level. Um, we've got a red pepper as well, um, which we always put with salads. And me likes having that raw. Um, and then we've got a pack of chicken here. Um, chicken breast fillets. I think there's four in there um, and some chorizo and we're going to do a it's a rice uh, just rice dish um, called chicken jambalaya. Um, what I'll try and do guys is link all the recipes down below for you um, so you've got them as well if you want to give them a try at home. Um, so in that I'm going to put some red kidney beans and we've got some plum baby plum tomatoes as well go in that too. Um, and also we've got a pizza here and we love to make our own um, or Amelia loves to make her own. Um, so we've got some pizza bases, there's two in a pack here. Um, we've got some wild rocket, we've got some mild pepperoni and some mozzarella. So obviously some of the cheeses, um, the cheddar cheese is going to go on that too and then some other ingredients that we already have. Um, so that's that meal and um, we've also got up here some baked rolls and a camembert um, which I haven't had since having the baby I know you obviously you can't have that when you're pregnant so I'm dying to try this again um, and give it a go I can't believe I haven't already yet since giving birth so that's a really really yummy one that I can't wait to have we're going to have some baked rolls with that um, we've got some nice uh, prawns here which we'll probably do a prawn curry with um, or something like that um, we love curry in this house um, Amelia does too as long as it's not too spicy um, so we've got some veg here as well which we can put into that so we've got baby corn um, we've got one of these and a courgette and a cucumber um, aubergine courgette and cucumber oh also forgot to say um, we've got an avocado which we could we normally do something like avocado on toast uh, for our lunches idea and um, we've got a bag of potatoes and I have to say recently we've been really been loving jacket potatoes with fillings on top um so like tuna cheese baked beans that sort of thing um, that's a really quick easy dinner as well to do um, we've also got a bag of carrots. Again, Amelia really enjoys having these raw as a snack, um, so she really likes them. Um, we did also pick up a frozen bag of chicken nuggets. There's 30 in here. Um, again, um, this sometimes is a lunch or just an emergency dinner if we're out late and I just want to throw something in the oven. I do like having something in the freezer just as a quick emergency. Um, another lunch idea of these, we like getting these tortellini, these are the sausage and cheese tortellini. Um, so we normally have this with butter um, and sort of herbs or sometimes we'll put it with sort of like a tomato -y sauce as well. And we've got some sweet chilli dipping sauce, we was, we was out of this and I really craved this last week so we've got some more of this. Um, we've got another can of red kidney beans um, and then on to the breakfasts. Um, we've got 
some eggs here with some bagels. Um, and again, we saw a really nice recipe where you sort of crack the egg into the middle of the bagel and put that in the air fryer. So it's another air fryer recipe that I really, really want to try. Um, so let me know if you want to see that. Um, and then we got some honey hoops and honey corn flakes. Um, and then some corned beef. I'm not a fan, but Sam, my husband, really is. So he loves getting that. Um, we've also really been into these folded flatbreads recently. Um, so again, we'll put some fillings in there, which we really, really like. Uh, we was also out of mayonnaise, so we picked up um, a can of their own mayonnaise. Um, and a loaf of white bread, so we get a medium soft loaf, which is fine for us. And also, Amelia really likes these fruity yogurts. Um, they're sort of their own version of fromage fray, so she really likes those. Um, and hay fever tablets. Whose hay fever has kicked in the last few days? Because mine has got so, so bad. It's like June starts and my hay fever just kicks in so, so quickly. Um, so I've picked up two packs of hay fever tablets. Um, and then just a couple of, well, actually just one cleaning product, so some bleach, um, and then some shower gel too. Um, so a very large milk behind here. We get through so much milk lately. Um, and then their own version of Lilt, which is free away. Actually really, really nice. Um, and these tortilla chips, which are sea salt and lime. So I thought they sounded absolutely delicious. So some of those um, and these as well which are their own version of Monster Munch. Amelia absolutely loves these. These ones are called Monster Claws. Um, a pack of malted, um, malted milk biscuits and also a pack of digestive chocolate biscuits. Um, we do love a little cup of tea and biscuit in the evening so they'll be enjoyed with that. Um, we picked up also their coffee tabs and onto the fruit um, we've got some mixed grapes here so we've got the red and the green and the strawberries as well so Amelia loves strawberries it's her absolute favourite fruit we're actually growing some in the garden as well um, so she, we've been well we actually picked the first one yesterday so she was really pleased about that um, so we've had to obviously get some more because she absolutely loves them um, we'll probably be going strawberry picking soon too um, a bunch of bananas they're just so handy to have take out on picnics and things um, bag of apples again Amelia loves apples um, and then some peaches too. So we've got lots and lots of fruit. We always get through so much fruit in this house, um, which is great. Um, now we picked up these a couple of weeks ago. These are the rosemary crackers. They are delicious, even just on their own. I mean, probably served with cream cheese and cucumber like they've got in the example would be even nicer, but they were just such a lovely little snack to have. We took them out on a picnic, they were lovely. Again, another great picnic one for Amelia are these chocolate animals. She really likes them. They're just easy to throw in her bag. Some mini rolls. Again, just really nice to have on picnic takeout. Um, and then we always do pick up a little treat from uh, the bakery. So there's a croissant there and a cookie. Um, and I just wanted to add, guys, that this all this shop here was £62 for us this week. Um, but we did... Um, this was, oh sorry, this is a little shop um, and we did actually get 10% off this week. So if you've actually got the little app and you scan it each week, um, each week you get different offers um, and then the best offer you can get is up to 10% off. So we reached that stage this week and got 10% off overall, which was fantastic for us. So we got some money off of our shop um, and also as well, the malted milks um were a free item a free gift for us as well which was a voucher on the app so you've got different vouchers as well on the app that you can um have as well so just it's worth checking um the app for those things because they do add up and you know 10 percent on a shop can be quite a bit um so that worked out really really well for us so I really hope you like this video guys, please do give it a nice big thumbs up if you did, um, just to let me know that you like this sort of content so I can make some more, and do go and consider subscribing if you do like this sort of thing, because it'll make